Hello, and welcome to the Daily Vision Bible. I'm Robbie H. You know, I am mindful of the fact that although this episode is pre-recorded a few days before its release, that this episode will be going out the day that I have to go to the job centre for a work-focused interview. Hopefully before that date, I should have pre-recorded enough episodes to last until the 1st of November. I would love the series to continue well after that date, so I pray that whoever does interview me sees the lives that my humble daily readings touch. Now, God has been my first and foremost work in this production. It's Leviticus 12 today, a short chapter regarding pregnancy. Some of you may disagree with what this chapter contains, but I ask you to remember that all I do is read God's holy word. So let us open God's word with prayer. Lord, I ask that as I read your word, that you reveal something new to me. I also ask that as people see and hear your word, they come to a better understanding of you. Amen. Leviticus chapter 12 Yahweh spoke to Moses, saying, Speak to the children of Israel, saying, If a woman conceives and bears a male child, then she shall be unclean seven days, as in the days of her monthly period she shall be unclean. In the eighth day, the flesh of her foreskin shall be circumcised. She shall continue in the blood of purification thirty-three days. She shall not touch any holy thing, will come into the sanctuary until the days of her pure thing are complete. If she bears a female child, then she shall be unclean two weeks, as in a period, and she shall continue the blood of purification sixty-six days. When the days of her purification are complete, for a son or for a daughter, she shall bring to the priest at the door of the tent of meeting a year old lamb for a burnt offering and a young pigeon, or a turtle dove for a sin offering. They shall offer it before Yahweh, and quest a cleansing for her, and she shall be cleansed from the fountain of her blood. This is the law for her who bears, whether a male or a female. If she cannot afford a lamb, then she shall take two turtle doves, or two young pigeons, one for a burnt offering, and the other for a sin offering. And the priest shall request a cleansing for her, and she shall be clean.